second quick question, if I may. Uh, British Muslims up and down the country will have seen these riots or demonstrations, whatever you like to call them, unfold. They've seen mosques get attacked. They've watched as shops have been looted. There have been chants, which some would say are grossly offensive. Partly, this has happened because of misinformation. They now say they feel unsafe. What is your message to the British Muslim community, and what are you willing to do to make sure they feel safe in their own home? Uh, well, taking both parts of that, I think it is really important to emphasise over and over again the price paid for those that put out misinformation and interfere in the work that the authorities are trying to do in Southport, the price is paid ultimately by the mums and dads who are grieving their children. Because if there isn't a fair trial that gives them the justice they demand, they are the ones that are going to suffer the most. And so nobody but nobody should pretend that they are speaking for those families when they involve themselves in activity like this. Because they are putting what is um, now the single most important thing for those families, which is to grieve properly um, and to have the justice to which they are entitled. Um, and that's why this is so important. In relation to the Muslim community, look, let me be very clear, I will take every step that's necessary to keep you safe. And that's why I said what I said about mosques being attacked because they're mosques. The far right is showing who they are. We have to show who we are in response to that, and that's why we pulled together this response this afternoon to try and coordinate and make sure that um, as we face the next few days and weeks, uh, we have the strongest possible uh, response uh, in order to ensure that there is safety for all of our citizens, including those Muslims who uh, will see, as you rightly say, attacks on their mosques because they're mosques. Thank you. Um, I've got John. What I do now, I do for my people and for Camelot. And may they forgive me. This is my last act as your king. Do not be afraid. All things change. Arthur of Camelot, and I command you now all to fight! Fight! I do not fight before! Never surrender! Never surrender! Fight! Burning! Burn everything! 